seconds from the start. Andre Bergeron having issues back in the back there. He's supposed to be in lane one, but he's well back through 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Mark, wow, good start for Steve Armstrong. Back in the boat for the first time since St. Felicia last year. He nails it as he heads down here to turn number one. A lot of rough water for these little boats as they go down here to turn one. On the inside, it'll be the five of Samuel Tremblay. Right out there, Steve Armstrong and Philip Millette as they go down the back stretch. Tommy Shannon opens up, and here comes Steve Armstrong in the 55. He's out about lane five. Samuel Tremblay powers back ahead now. Three boats within one rooster tail. Tremblay is your leader with Steve Armstrong on the outside. Philip Millette sandwiched in the middle. Norm Shannon back, or Tommy Shannon back in fourth position. They come through the apex in turn number one and around here to complete lap number one. It'll be the five of Samuel Tremblay. Come off the exit pit and lead lap number one. It'll be one down and four to go. Great heat. Shaping up for second between Steve Armstrong in the 55 to my way and Philip Lett in the seventh, the airspeed. More position is Tommy Shannon. The Valley Field Auto Park. Fifth place to Downey DeMera. And the 44, the Wave Dancer. And Andre Bergeron having all sorts of mechanical issues back here at six. But it's all Sam Tremblay here on lap number two. Opened up by almost two full rooster tails on the top of Steve Armstrong. But Steve Armstrong is trying to march into it. He started out about late five or six. Now he can start to move over a little bit. Running within about two and a half rooster tails. Back to second position to Steve Armstrong. Third position, no left, fourth position. Tommy Shannon. In the four, they come off the edge of the turn number two. It'll be two down and three to go. Samuel Tremblay. Out of Valleyville, Quebec, Canada is your leader. Steve Armstrong out of Brockville, Ontario. Back in second position. Philip Lett out of Valleyfield in third in the airspeed. Everybody's starting to get spread out a little bit. Tommy Shannon. In Valleyfield, all the parts back in fourth position. Samuel Tremblay now by three full rooster tails over top of Steve Armstrong. Open it up a little bit as they go down the back stretch. As I was saying, this is the first race for Steve since an accident back in St. Felicien last summer. And the boat looks really good. He looks really comfortable behind the wheel once again. Great to see him back. Dominic DeVere on the outside of Andre Berger. These guys have some issues in the back of the pack. Come around and complete their second lap. Michael Tremblay comes around to complete lap number three. Three down and two to go for Samuel Tremblay. Steve Armstrong in the my way, holding on to second position. Hanging it easy, going across the bumps here at the start finish line. Third place, Philip Lett in the seventh. The airspeed. We're going to leave for now, coming off the eighth minute turn number one. CS5, Samuel Tremblay, he's going to put the 18 a lap down. And if he can, he'll come around and put Dominic DeMera also a lap down. Samuel Tremblay goes through the turn number two. Dominic DeMera's having mechanical issues. Breaks down kind of almost right in front of Sam. Sam does a good job to avoid him. Goes around the outside of him. And he'll come around and get the white flag. One more lap around. For the five. Samuel Tremblay. Second position, Steve Armstrong going to put him. 18 to lap down as well. Steve Armstrong gets the white flag. And Philip Lett, we've lost Tommy Shannon in the middle of the race course and Dominic DeMers here. Let's get all the five of Samuel Tremblay as he goes down the back stretch here. By a half a straightaway on the rest of the field. Samuel Tremblay opened it up now. He goes down here to turn number two and he'll come around and get the checkered flag. Steve Armstrong still holding on to second position. A great run for Steve back in the hydro. For the first time in a long time. Steve Armstrong back in it. But it's been all Sam Tremblay from the get-go. He'll come off the end of turn number two. And he'll see the checkered flag this time by. Samuel Tremblay in the CS5 out of Valley Hill Quebec wins. He, 20, and the 2.5 stops. Second place is going to Steve Armstrong in the 55, the my way. Taking it over for Alexis Weber. Steve out of Brockville. Driving to 55. In third place, Philip Lent in the airspeed. Picks up third place for it. Their first heat of 2.5 liter stocks in the books up next heat. 1B.
So we'll get these boats hooked up to the... Uh